my girl for the first time, but then there's no blood. How do I know if she's a virgin? Is she really a virgin? Or you're a woman and you are like, I, this is my first time of having sex, but then there's no blood. Okay, I didn't have any discharge of blood. What is going on? Why has maybe has someone raped me without me knowing and all those stuff? Calm down. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so very happy to guys here as always. Okay, and then if you're new here, you're welcome. Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Gloria, and here I share a lot, especially when it comes to our health. Okay, you're welcome. All my thumbs subscribers, I'm so glad to have you back again. Now, today we are going to be talking about this everything about hey man virginity why she's not she didn't see any blood or why you didn't notice any blood after having the first sex okay and everything okay now this has caused a lot of issues in several homes okay i've seen a lot of couples who have been together for years but then they still have these grudges in their heart she said that she's a virgin but then i found out that she's not a virgin she still insists insist on lying to me i've seen a lot of people having this issue like they didn't separate actually but then they are still having it in their heart and a lot of women they still have questions that are not uh, answered they are sure in their heart that they have not had such a uh, they have not had intercourse for the first time that was the first time this is the first person that has flowered me but then why am i still not seen i didn't see any blood and then he thinks that i am lying you know all the confusion and all that now calm down and watch this video to the end you will understand all that and why it happens okay now the first thing you should understand is that this timing we are talking about is not something that you can it's not a complete thing that covers your in genital at uh, your vagina okay it doesn't cover your vagina completely it covers it in a half like a, a kind of half okay now let me also tell you guys that there are people that can actually have their hymen intact but then they have had a sexual intercourse okay yeah a lot of people like that i know that you'd be surprised to hear this but then there are a lot of people that have had sex several times like two three two or more but then they still have the hymen intact and when you meet them you finally and um, maybe you possibly um tear the part of that hymen and then you are like okay you're debilitating your mental you virgin but she is not because she have actually had intercourse okay she have had intercourse already but then you are debilitating so this is one thing you should understand it's something that can that can actually hang in there it doesn't cover the vagina now during this particular as a woman okay during the time you're growing up if you have had things like riding a bicycle okay riding a horse doing various exercises okay having a maybe you had a an issue that led you to the hospital and there was a kind of vagina examination these things can cause the assignment to be teared to be teared okay and then when it comes to the time when you are going to have your first intercourse you are expecting to see blood but you will not see it okay now you also understand that the level of blood that you're going to see during this first time varies depending okay because this hymen is not the same just the way even a man's um, genital is not the same size that's how this hymen is not in this uh, the same level or the same way, way and different women okay so you have your own in a different way and if it has been teared through other exercises if been through swimming through using tampons if you have been using tampons as a, a vision you might have teared your um, hymen through this process okay a lot of other processes all those things that can actually cause even climbing a hill can actually tear your hymen and you're waiting for that day to come and showcase yourself but at the end, it did not happen. And as a man, you are disappointed. She has been telling me that she's a virgin. But then she is not. Okay. Now, I want you to understand that the blood that you are going to see that day or a tear in the hymen is not actually a 100% way to show that she is a virgin. Which I'm going to show you what actually shows. Okay. How to know if she's a virgin. I'm going to show, I'll tell you that in this video. So, but this is not hundred percent way to show the law of women that have a thicker hymen which can never be teared by all these things we are talking about but there are ones that have this slight one that if they had a riding bicycle 
even a thicker one can be teared to this process okay so these are the things you should understand and as a woman you should stop thinking that you um what you're going to show your partner or what you're going to give your partner as a um, a love package or whatsoever is your hymen because what if is not intact there and it's not your fault it has happened because of one thing or the other and as a man this is not one thing you should hold as if as if you want to find out ask her and another way to find out is if that particular place is thick it is a kind of more not wide enough okay because the first time is going to be more thick okay it's going to be more like you are going to experience a kind of tightness okay that is the main thing and then asking her if she tells you with all her heart that she is a virgin then she's a virgin okay there's no need to doubt it but then through all these things it's, it's not 100 percent because a lot of other things can actually cause this okay so this is one thing we should understand and as a woman have this in mind that this is not 100% thing that you want to go and present. I'm waiting and all you are waiting is not, you are not waiting that you don't want to um, sell your body. You're just waiting for this opportunity to go and showcase your body. That is not it, okay? Because this particular hymen is not a guarantee. It's, it can tear at any time. Even when you're doing other things and you're waiting to go and showcase yourself. And on that day, on that day, you are going to be disappointed. And I say, man, this is not one thing you should be looking at, okay? Ask her and then find out through her attitude and how that place is that very first day, how she feels and how that place is also. Those are the ways uh, you can know if she's a virgin. And then this is not the main thing you should be looking at or looking for, okay? Because the main thing you should be looking for from your partner is that love, okay, that she should be giving to you not the hymen okay because this is not 100 percent going to be the year for every woman okay so if you have been having this issue and you're like oh my goodness i had sex but then the first time no blood that is the reason okay so calm down there's nothing wrong it's just natural it happens to a lot of women so if it has happened to you calm down okay calm down it's natural and not every woman is going to experience this blood on the first day okay so that's what i want us to understand which i actually promised us on my last video that i'm going to be doing this video so if you have any questions let me know in the comment section okay and if you haven't hit that subscribe button you have not liked this video what are you waiting for hit that like button hit the notification bell so that i will know that you actually love this video you love this channel you love this person here yeah? okay so that's it for today's video see you guys in my next video